to do a money count on how much I made tonight in the audition. <laughs> Hello. Um, so in this video, this is going to be a video on auditions today. I am going to be auditioning at this club that I talked. I should have dropped the video of figure modeling and auditioning, and I didn't make it on time to that audition, so I missed it. So today we're going to be way on time, um, but definitely check out that video and whatnot because it's very, very interesting. And there's a lot that I do talk about in that video that is a very teachable moment, moment, especially like when it comes to figure modeling and whatnot. So check out that video. So I have a really, really good feeling that I'm gonna get into this club. So I'm gonna be getting up, watering my plants, tidying the, the house, and then I'm gonna sit and schedule, you know what I'm saying? Uh, work on my board, you know what I'm saying? And schedule and um, then from there, I'm going to probably like work on some editing. I want to work on some web tunes. I will be getting ready around six because like I said, I'm going to be on time today because they do not play. I missed it by a couple of minutes. So yeah, that's pretty much going to be my day. I kind of feel like I go with the flow when it comes to vlogs. So stay tuned on this journey because I'm, I'm going to tell y'all it's going to be interesting. <laughs> hey guys, so I just finished doing my makeup, I'm just combing out my hair. I feel like in my, my latest videos, my hair was looking like mad crazy and like scraggly and stuff. I washed it. So that was like the biggest thing with this hair. I washed it and I used Revlon brush blow dryer and my hair has been like staying down a lot, lot better. And on top of that, it's been easy, easier to like come comb through and whatnot. So anyway, it is um, 7.40 something. So, like I said, I'm gonna be out. I don't even know what the fuck I did with my neck. Going to be leaving, I would say in the next like 20 minutes. I don't wanna be like super early, but I wanna be early enough. So I've decided to uh, do two braids in my hair and I forget how thick my hair is. So I probably kind of look, hopefully it doesn't look that weird. Anyway, I'm about to like lay down my edges. Then we're gonna like head on, head on out. And like I said, get there early today. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to work tonight. I kind of have a feeling I might not be able to because last time when I got hired, they would like just come back tomorrow and work or whatever. So it might be the same thing. I might be able to work tonight. I don't know, but we'll see how it goes. So I'll check y'all in a little bit. So as you can see, I finished laying down my hair, my hair is like really, really flat, not frizzy and shit. I'm feeling cute, I'm feeling good. So it is, I think eight o'clock right now. So I'm just gonna like brush my teeth and my car is pretty much packed up and everything. So yeah, I'm gonna skid out, but we looking good. guarantee me to get in i feel like it guarantees more access you know what i'm saying i feel like it definitely i wouldn't say it's a guarantee you know what i'm saying because the woman that owns the actual club it's a woman that owns the club so there's that that makes me feel really good um and we had to go up to her and like sign the pay uh, like there was a paper out the hand to her and i said you know hello and it's nice to meet you and whatnot um i just smiled i didn't know what else to say to her or whatever i was actually really nervous and i think that's why the 
the beginning for me was so messy is because I was actually nervous like even me like I still get nervous you know what I'm saying I still get fucking nervous and it's like I will sit here and say there was some people I don't I don't know who but someone threw money and I think it was one of the customers that were there but at the end of the day I'm just gonna sit here and manifest also a, another funny fucking thing my friends that I actually did a show back in March when I did a I think I think it was a soul bloom when I did so bloom um <clears throat> my friend that I bought with me for that festival she was there and I was like oh shit you know so I thought that was like interesting like not even interesting I thought that was like barely cool because I'm like oh okay it was just like meant to fucking be <laughs> you know what I'm saying it wasn't I wasn't meant to go last week I was meant to go now so anyway yeah, like I feel good you know what I'm saying I I think one of the things that I am nervous about and of course like you know my friend is talking to everybody you know what I'm saying and whatnot um I think one of the biggest things like if I don't and I really don't want to speak this but if anything it might just be my wig because clearly uh, I got the moves I I know how to dance I know how to bring a stage presence and all that and more and grab people's attention and stuff like that so I know how to do all of that so he did say within three days if you don't hear anything that means you didn't get in but that doesn't mean that that's the end all be all result it might be your style it might be the, your hair it might be you know whatever it might be you know what I'm saying that might be the reason why I didn't get in the club so yeah but at the same time we'll see you know what I'm saying we'll see how things go because at least I know like if I don't now I don't want to speak this into existence but I just feel like if I don't that's really because of my hair <laughs> you know what I'm saying it's just because of my fucking hair and I was kind of going with like a Barbie type vibe you know what I'm saying so hopefully they get that vibe um but maybe that may not be the vibe of the club so we'll we'll have to see uh, I'll let you know in a couple of days video i'm going to do a money count uh with you goddesses on how much i made tonight in the audition i think this is it so this is it but i wanted to say something that i thought was really wild and this has happened at every place that i have auditioned at every club that i've auditioned at so when i got there i'm just like this you know like i don't feel like you can really see me, right? You can't really see me. So I'm talking and whatever. I go to find a space to like put my stuff, da da da, whatever. The place was packed. There was like 20 something girls there. So anyway, I find a bench to go put my stuff and get ready over there. So as I walk over there, this girl, she was like, I know you. <laughs> I was like, what? She was like, you're a pole goddess, right? And I was like, yeah. <laughs> So she's like, yeah, I've been following you for a while. And she was like, I actually like DM'd you like a year ago for classes or da da da. And I was like, what the fuck? It, it was kind of like a little bit surreal tonight. I'm not gonna lie. Like that, and like I said, it happens every single time I go to audition at a club. Someone always knows me, always knows me. And it's always a surreal moment and a humbling moment too. And just like a very like gratitude, a lot of gratitude because it's like, wow, like, okay, like I really have made that many connections where I go to clubs and stuff. And again, I don't, I don't go walking around thinking that people are going to know me ever. But yeah, so anyway, let's get into the money. So this is how much I made on stage. Let's go ahead and count. So I have $23 exactly from tonight's audition, um, which is good. You know what I'm saying? From an audition, I came home with $23. I feel really good. And I'm just gonna like say this. I'm gonna end this video here. Within three days, I should hear something back. If you have yet to subscribe to my motherfucking channel, this is now the time. Definitely subscribe and show some love on that like button. Because like I said, either you will see me in the motherfucking club and I'm just gonna manifest that. You know what I'm saying? So surprise, bitch. <laughs> we'll see what's to come.